Hello, 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 everybody. Oh my goodness. Hold on while it finds the game to capture. There we go. It's apparently raining here in Old Stream Farms. Lord. Just checking frame rates here. Let's close the door. I'll leave the door open while it's raining. Okay. It's raining. Raining like nobody's business. Alright, we have to cultivate a field. was using that. Alright. There we go. Uh, lower the harrow. Alright, let's roll. I've been playing with the graphics to see if I get graphics better. Or worse, or something. Uh, but... We'll see. We'll see what happens. Watch frame rates and everything. Game Farm, how's it going? How's it going? It's raining here in Old Stream Farms. Well, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna soldier on we're trying to get our fields already um, please let me know if the stream looks weird um, I, I've been playing with the graphics so yeah we'll see we'll see we'll probably have another serious leg out when we get Close to this water again, but there's nothing I can really do about that. Hopefully, y'all are doing well. Are you just moving along? That's right, we are moving along here. Rusher, everybody in stream last night was wishing you were there. Because I apparently spent all the money we had in Car Mechanic Simulator. We literally went from having nearly a half million dollars to having like $20,000. <laughs> Everyone was like, oh my goodness, if Rusher was here, this wouldn't have happened. But it did. It's all right. <laughs> well, I mean, we have two school buses and like 16 other vehicles I think I can just flip for quick money. So, I mean, the first one we tried to flip for quick money is going to require a whole bunch more engine work, but I think we can still do it. To. I know what I was meaning to do today, which I never got around to because I started doing, I started cleaning my shop. <laughs> oh, I needed some icons made, and I was going to dry some really terrible icons to make DOS intervene and fix them. <laughs> oh well. Uh, hopefully by next week I'll have the um, little icon thingies I need to do something. So, yeah, we'll have to delay that another week. Oh well. Pouring down rain, but darn it, we're going to get this field cultivated. Because, because darn it, that's, that's just the thing we need to do. It's a small field. We'll, we'll figure out what we're going to plant here in a minute. I think we looked last time at the... Uh, what's available to plant, but we'll, we'll get something put in here in a minute. 
Hey Doss, if you're listening, can you do me a favor? You're not hurrying around to mix the water in, right? No, I'm just. I don't think Doss is listening. She's not listening. Okay. You know what we're going to do? Uh, Jake, how's it going? No, not that. Come on. We're going to watch the hired worker for a minute. I need to do something really quick, and DOS isn't in the stream, so I need to actually step away and do that. So let's watch the hired worker for a moment. Oh my goodness, the hired worker failed already. Good grief. <laughs> Don't wrap yourself in a tree for the millionth time, right? Wally, how's it going? Oh, it looks like there's been a car crash or a standoff. I don't know. All right, let's leave the hired worker be for now. We'll have to fix this because, yeah, hired worker. Okay, we got $160,000. We have one problem, which is we cannot plant with the tractor we have because we bought ourselves a L Cheapo 45 horsepower rig. And also, we have no cows. We need Q. We need Q. So, let's close that again. I do love those. <laughs> this would be the... I would love to own a farm like this. Oh, I would love to own a farm like this. Um, okay, so we need to... Um, yeah, we're going to have to... Well, do we want to... <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, they're, they're doing something-ish, right? Just not that part of it? That's fine. Whatever. Um... Okay, so let's look and see. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, 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 thinking. Where? Well, does it matter too much? If we bought ourselves an animal transport system, we could transport ourselves um, a few cows and a few pigs. It might be cheaper just to... Uh, might be cheaper just to have them transported for us. We'll have to find where is the where is the animal dealer? There's the animal dealer down there. Okay, which makes sense because there's the shop. Buy the cows late spring, early summer, because with seasons the cows can eat the grass in their pen. Okay, are we in? What are we in? Early spring? Okay. How about the sheep? What do we think about sheep? Because I kind of like sheep as an entry-level animal. Um, just, just saying, entry-level animal. Um, I am going to, however, need to rent ourselves a cedar. Let's see here. What do we got in terms of planters and cedars? Oh, boy. What do we got here? Well... I never under I I I'm always I'm always like planter versus cedar. To me, it does the same blooming thing, but we're gonna need one of these. Um, 85 horsepower, so we're only like 50 horsepower short in our tractor. Um, I went looking for mods on the mod hub to see if I could find something with that required less power, and I couldn't find a thing. So, um, I think we're gonna go with. 180 horsepower. You know what? If we're gonna if we're gonna have to rent a tractor anyway, guys, why not like rent a decent? So that's three meters. Let's um. Train man, how's it going? All sheep need is grass, hay, and water, and pigs need all the things. Yeah, pigs. Yeah, they're pigs. They want all the things. 
I'm saying if we have to rent, if we have to already have to rent a tractor to, to seed, why not grab a big seeder to make it go fast? So we're like, bish, bash, bash, done. I'm thinking. This one happens to be a drill. That's nice. Yeah, not previously cultivating or plowing necessary. Nice. Um, we're not we're not going to care that much. Um, kind of thinking something like that, something big. We can we can run super fast. This one fertilizes while it's running. So we've already limed, but we could also fertilize. Yep, fertilization active or inactive, doesn't matter. Fertilization active. So our least cost would be 5,300 bucks and cultivates. Well, yeah, it does, but we already got the hard worker cultivating, so whatever. I'm thinking this one would be worth it to lease. We're going to need to le lease a 270 horsepower tractor, but whatever. Um, nothing wrong with that. So let's, do, do I want to lease? Yeah, let's lease it. Yeah. All right. Now we need ourselves a tractor that can pull it. So let's get ourselves 270 horsepower tractor. Um, there's a lot of trackers in here. You know what? Shoot, if we're going to do it, we're going to do it. We're going to go big or go home. Um, let's see what we got. Let's go to the end of the line here. Well, we got 22,000 for a six-cylinder versatile. Um, not going to be powerful enough. I mean, that's 200. That's 85,000 for that. That's not powerful enough. <laughs> uh, Voltra... We can get ourselves a big bud. <laughs> yeah, nope. Um, alrighty, let's see here. That's okay. Let's. I'm kind of looking at prices too. So we need 270 horsepower. So I think this is probably what we're gonna want. One of these two. They're identical tractor, as far as I can tell. Agra bumper. I don't need a. I don't. I don't need any of that. Go away. GPS. No, I don't know how to use that. Don't care. Uh, standard wheels set up. I think we're okay with that. Lease cost is only going to be 12000 Sweet. All right. Hired worker, could you figure to sort yourself out already, woman? Case New Holland, same thing, right? Now we have to take the long walk. It's the walk of shame. We don't have a truck. Now I'm I'm really wishing for um, Summerlin Farms. He's got a mod in his game that lets you go like super fast, and it's amazing. Take the taxi, Rusher. That means spending money, man. I don't want that. We're also gonna stop at the cow farm, <laughs> and that's and that's no bull. <laughs> Can I get in there? Woohoo! Alrighty. Uh, animal pens. Horse paddock. Large picking coop. Large chicken coop. Ooh, yeah. Alright. Let's get some chickens. Because chickens are chickens and that's good. So, Cornish Cross. Rhode Island Red. Or Rooster. Um... Why are these one dollar? Why are these a dollar a holler? Chickens. Oh wait, they're M's, which would involve that they are male, in my theory. So a white leghorn, foghorn leghorn, and a Rhode Island red. Ooh, them pretty birds. Not like my sister's birds. My sister's birds look like dinosaurs. Um, <laughs> uh, Cornish crosses are grown for meat. Oh, I see. Um, 
requires an amount of feed in between that of a lane and meat counterpart. Oh, that's right. I have to buy meat for the or feed for these animals. Screw that. <laughs> I think we have to. Chicken shipping used to be horribly expensive. Oh, those chicken shipping uh, monopolies. The chicken shipping mafia had control of the chicken shipping. Don't say that too fast. It just comes out wrong. All right, we're going to a John Deere dealer to pick up our, see, I didn't do that. I didn't break that sign. Um, pick up our whatever we bought. I don't even remember what we bought. Um, New Holland? No, we bought a case. I think we bought a case in case case shows up because then he can be happy that we bought a case. Just in case. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. Uh, I need seedage, don't I, guys? Seedage. Seedage. Big bag of seed. That's chicken feed. Chicken feed, that seed. Right there. That's a thousand. Lord, how much does this thing haul? Alright, let's, let, let's find out. If you peel a sticker off the case, it might say Fiat. Do we think our worker actually finished? Because I don't think our worker did. I think our worker is full of lies. No, not that. Do I need to hook up anything else? I don't look like it. First, you need to fill the tool. Right. But how much? That's the question. All right, let's see here. Let's buy ourselves a bag of seed. Yep, one bag of seed. Thank you, game. And solid fertilizer, right? Yeah. Buy ourselves some fertilizer. It's raining. Why, yes, brew, it is. It is raining. Um, our okay, that gave us 50%, so hopefully that'll work. And then we're going to go fill up our seed. And we'll see what that does. Rain is wet. Brew's helpful tip of the day. Thank you, Brew. 33%. Yeah, train man, I'm not even going to try that because you know exactly what's going to happen. Silly, silly things. All right, let's buy... Actually, no, let's not because we don't actually know how much we're going to need in our tractor until we get to the field and start trattering. You're off to bed. All right, Brew. Hopefully you start feeling better. Quit, quit wrecking yourself. All right, we got ourselves a nice tractor. This is a nice tractor. Too bad we can never afford it. <laughs> uh, all right, let's go this way. Having a lot of mods, mods is fun until the whole left side of the screen is full of the help HUD. Yeah, yeah, you're right. That's why I, I just, a lot of times I fail because I just close the help HUD and just try to figure it out. But, you know. Can we seed in the rain? I would think we could seed in the rain. Logically, in my brain, you can seed in the rain. Oh my goodness, I'm a poet. I didn't even know it. think I can seed. We'll find out. We'll try and see what happens. What's the worst that can happen? Nothing. In game, yes. Okay. Yay, in game. <laughs> Ready. Uh, all right. What? There, that's what I needed. Unfold sower. Ooh, what do we 
we going to, uh, what are we going to sow, guys? I forgot to check that. Is it Alt S? Yeah. Wheat, barley, oat, canola, sunflower. So what are we going to, let's see. I could get stuck in mud. I could, and then it would become mud runner. Uh, wheat, barley. Ooh, wheat, because, right, we can feed, can we feed wheat to, can we feed wheat to chickens? Right? And then and then sheep need straw. No, sheep don't need straw. Yeah, sheep need straw. No, they don't. I don't remember. I think we need one wheat and one train man wants canola. Should write down how much you used in seed and furt on the fields. I should. You're right. You should do that, Rusher. <laughs> wheat and barley for chickens and sheep don't need the straw. Okay, good. So we're going to do canola. So that's logical. Um, come on now, game. There we go. Uh, why? Canola. Canoli, oli, oli, oli. All right, let's make sure we're sort of straightened out here. Uh. I don't know how to drive. I don't know how to reverse while looking backwards. It's just not a thing. All right, here we goes. I thinks. Uh huh. Lower the soa. Ah, what happened? Okay, things seem to be okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're good. All right, turn on the sower and let's roll. Let's get ourselves sowing some canola. And then, because the sheep just need grass, I'm kind of thinking, and this is just me thinking right now. Elvis, how's it going? I'm kind of thinking that maybe I sow that front field with grass <clears throat> because it would provide grass and hay. And it's a small field. It's not that amazing. That would mean that we just kind of wasted the uh, whole liming of that field. But... No, I just about tried to reach and right click because I've been playing Farmer's Dynasty <laughs> and right click gives you engineer vision. Like, nope, doesn't work in this game. I'm doing good there, Elvis. Thank you for asking. All right, that should be off now. Yep. Come on, Tratter. You can do it. Whoa. Come on, that tracker. We can do this thing. So in that front field, not a bad idea with grass. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of thinking, but I mean, we would have just, we would, we just wasted our liming on that field, but it would let us get the sheep. Which wouldn't be a bad thing. I just realized something. Do I have to actually? No. Okay. Theoretically, it's fertilizing. Theoretically, we're fertilizing while we're driving. Come on, Trier. Go. Go, Trier. Grass fields take lime as well, so it wasn't waste. Okay. I mean, yeah. Then, then we could. It's a small field. We can get it, get it in grass relatively quickly. Back up the hill here. Come on, Tratter, you can do it. Come on, we bought you for power. Oh, we're not going to get much power out of it, but. Do you have anybody? Oh, we put a thousand. We put a thousand in each. Anybody keeping keeping track of the numbers? We put a thousand liters of fur and seed in there. Now, here comes a silly question. Some of you are going to be like, "Oh my gosh, that is such a stupid question." 
but I'm going to ask it anyway because I've been playing so many farming games and they are all kind of like stuck in my head. We're not going to use all of our seed and fertilizer in this in this exercise, right? There's no way. In at least one other game, I can empty my seed and fertilizer back into my holding container. Am I just SOL in farm sim? I can unload it and use it later. Okay, where do I unload it? Maybe that's a better question. <laughs> like I literally have not touched farm sim since the last stream, other than to boot it up early to download the mod updates and search for a cedar that a 35 horsepower tractor could run which I didn't succeed in that so come on Trevor come on look at this guys We're, this is like super fast oh my goodness if only I could have a cedar like this in Farmer's Dynasty good gravy We'll talk about that tomorrow when we stream Farmer's Dynasty, but holy moly. Oh, I, I've got the keyboard here, so I can always do that. Um, we'll just finish sewing, and then we'll figure that out. And up. Loop around. Where am I going? See if we can get ourselves back up the hill. We, we, we're going to need to rush. Are we going to need to budget for one of these big old trackers? Big old tractor with a lot of power. We need more power, though. I think we need a, uh, a tractor with, um, with tracks. Eh, tractor with tracks. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's what? A good 300 grand, probably, to get a good one. I could get a Fiat, but who wants a Fiat? Um, that should be our entire field done and dusted. Lift and fold. Nice, nice, nice. So, in field four, now I'm looking for a way to record this. Uh, that piece of paper should work for now until I can find a, I'll end up putting it in a spreadsheet. <laughs> Field four. Oh man, now where's my pan? There it is. Field four with canola because I, are we sure that the seed and fer the fertilizer rates don't matter? But are we sure the seed rates um, stay the same if I were to switch to a different? Um, oh, where's field four? There it is. Um, planted, good, fertilized, sweet. Um, are we sure that the the seed rates are always change between crops? Okay, that's what I figured. All right, so we had a thousand. So. I'm gonna be really lazy. So a thousand seven sixty one and the seeds eight sixty nine. Okay. So we know that. Bow shell. Oh, let's not drive with my keyboard because we'll just end up crashing because the the wheel the, the wheels are set up for the the steering system is set up for running on the controller. All right, our hired worker was appropriately terrible, but it did stop raining, so. That's a thing. Cyronin, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the farm. Put the tracker here. 
we'll come back and I do like I, I love old tractors like this it would be that'd be my kind of vehicle to own this big this big important special new beast here is just yeah, like me all right let's uh, get ourselves sorted here uh, we're gonna need to do shoot was it a yes aha Okay, lower down. We're good to go. Oh, we got to choose our crop. We got to choose our crop. Um, thank you, Rusher. <laughs> we got to choose our crop. Come on, game. Recognize that I got controller. Thank you. Um, soybeans, oilseed, radish, grass. Are we sure we don't? We want to do grass up here. I'm kind of thinking that's the, probably the best to do grass. Still a pretty decent field. Uh, I think it's I think it's probably for the best. Let's let's go ahead and do it. We'll run the grass out here. Um, can always make hay out of it and sell extra. You're right. You're right, Rusher. You are correct. Okay, let's. Um, we got it down. We got it done. Okay, let's roll. Get this. Get this field done. See if we can't uh, avoid hitting any fence poles or thing poles or whatever. I think I can actually clip through them. Nope, cannot clip through them. <laughs> you could on the old Farm Sim 13 version of this map. <laughs> Ugh. All right, let's see if we can avoid. There we go. Oh, this is going to be more difficult over here. All right. Got that? Ooh, just barely. All right. I like how it's it's right up against the base of this uh, this power pole. Go. All right, there we go. A little bit, little bit more to the left. Oh, come on now. Nah. Get around there, buddy boy. How's it going? There we go. We made it finally. We're just trying to we're just trying to hurry a little bit so that we can uh, return our cedar and tratter get it off lease because we don't want to spend more than the five grand it took us to get it off lease to begin with. Is it actually going to cultivate that or is it just my imagine? No, it's really going to cultivate it. Okay, good. Well, I didn't have to spend the seven hundred dollars on worker pay, but meh, we'll live with it. It's fine. Ducks, we got ducks. Probably more useful than the ducks in Farmer Dynasty. I know any farmer is like, oh my gosh, you are so terrible. I know. <laughs> I know. It's okay though. We'll make it. We'll survive. We will survive. Maybe. So once we get this planted, we're gonna have to wait forever and a day for anything to happen. So we're gonna have to find a way to make some money. So that means contracts. Yay, contracts. So we'll be looking at that here as soon as we're done with this field. I think I got the entire thing, but I'm going to go right up back across here just to be sure. I suddenly have old songs in my head. Uh, turn off the sower, lift... Wait, what did I do? Lift the sower, fold the sower. There we go. I will survive. Yes. All right. So that was grass. 
field whatever this was, field six. Grass. The fertilizer was 761 minus 615, and the seed was 869 minus 744, whatever those numbers are. I will fi figure that out later. All right, so first things first. First things first. Nope, nope. First things first. Get out of the tractor. All right, first things. Oh, wait. No, wait. Get back in the tractor. All right, I got to figure out how to unload. So. Where are we going to unload? Probably somewhere over here makes the most sense. Um, well, kind of in there actually makes the most sense where, where we got the plow, so. we all right, now. I and is that everything that is everything sweet where did it put it ah perfect one of them is in there that's great but whatever okay so first things first we go to our garage and we go to our oh wait least items and return that and return that woohoo okay i i personally think we should get a refund on our lease costs but you know whatever okay so we we done did that we got everything we got it sown and fertilized I'll have to figure out the whole weeding thing later we'll probably we'll just rent one of those thin wheeled things to do the 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 sprain later. We'll worry about that later. So let's go with contracts. Let's see what do we got. Transport. No, thank you. Plowing. Boo. Sewing. Ugh. All right. I want. I want a high dollar. Nine acres. Okay, you're the high dollar boy, huh? Field sixteen. Be sure to fill the tool with seeds. Eee. 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 Well, I mean, I assume I'm gonna have to buy that, but. There we go. Okay. Let's, um, let's go. Um, since somehow I got rid of the ability to tab I don't remember what I did. Uh, the guys from the shop came up to get it. Yeah, I should have actually driven it all the way out there. I knew I was going to have to lease the equipment. I should have driven this out there because then we wouldn't be walking, taking another walk of shame all the way to the shop. Uh, well. Oh, well. So like, So like us, isn't it? All right, we're gonna try to earn six grand. That will, well, it won't be quite six. It'll be about five and change. That should cover what we paid to lease the, tra the tractor and the uh, C, no, it won't. It'll kind of pay for the tractor, I think. And then we'll look to see what other contracts we can get because our hope is we'll, uh, we'll be able to pay for um, for the equipment that we we leased. All right. Oh, did they buy seed for us? Oh no, that's the seed that we bought. Never mind. Uh, okay. Yeah, I know to start the engine, but I can't remember how to do that with the <laughs> the controller. Um. Oh, it's one of these confusing ones. Okay, you, you, you have that you connect somehow. I'm sure you connect somehow. Where, how would you connect? Wait, do I connect you? That's a three-pointer. 
And then that connects, no, that does not connect like that, okay. That goes on the front. That can't be right. That's got the hoses, so I'm gonna guess that that goes, no, that has hoses too. Little one in front, large one on back. Okay, thank you, train man. Okay. <laughs> we all hooked up. We are. We got. We got those things. All right. So now, lifter, lifter. Whoa. Wait. Fold sewer. Wolfman, how's it going? How was the uh, how was the hunting? All right, now we got to put this on the front. Not like that. We don't put it on the front. Whoa! We got no weight on our steering wheels. Oh lord! Oh lord! All right, let's uh, get that hooked up. Oop. And hook those up. We're good. Now, lift additional tank. Oh, look at that. That's a cool looking little rig. Now, they want us to buy some seed. Why do we have to buy seed? That seems... That seems counterintuitive. Oh, well. We'll buy some seed. Alrighty. Big bag of seed. All right, Wolfman. Um, big seed bag. We'll buy that. Everyone's gonna say you didn't have to buy that. Yeah, but I did anyway. Alrighty. Uh, okay, so it's open. Refill. There. Oh wow. Is that okay? That's. Hopefully, that's what I was supposed to be doing right there. All right, that's 36%. Now we're heading to field. Cracker Jacks. Field 16. Where the blazes is field 16? It's over there by the bogiest plant. All right, let's go. Let's get in the tracker so we can drive a little bit better. Let's get that out of our screen so we can see a little better. Wow, look at that. That. That touch screen thing on there man this computer whoop this computer this ca this computer is a tractor <laughs> that's, that's probably an accurate statement actually this computer happens to be a tractor uh where in the blazes are we going again okay i'll go that way Zettler, enjoy your lawn mowing. I did that yesterday. Only I didn't have much lawn to mow, so there you go. Most of our grass is dead. <laughs> uh, stop. No, thank you. Uh, 16 is somewhere this direction. Oh, it's over there. I should have taken some turn. I hope we're going to take this dirt track. It's got to get us over there. Whoa. Hold on, everybody. Um, no, we're not going to run across someone's grass or field. That would be a bad idea. Hold on, everybody. I don't know how. Woohoo! Bouncy. Wee! Whoop! Hold on. All right. Let's see if we can sneak up this little ridge right here. Looks like we can. Okay, we have arrived at field 16. Holy moly, no wonder he's paying us six grand for this. All right, let's see what we can do about this. All right, first things first. Turn myself around. Fold this down. Back up a little bit. Then lower it down. Lower it. Nope, lower it. We do not want corn. That is that button. He wants sunflowers. Yep. 
sunflowers. All right, here we go. I feel like it's not working. It's not, is it? No, it's not. Okay, what did I do wrong? <sighs> All right, we'll, we'll get it, we'll get it. It just takes a little bit of effort, apparently. Whoop. Oh my goodness, looking backwards and driving backwards is not, I need, I should use mirrors. I should use mirrors. I'm better at reversing with mirrors. Good gravy. Good gravy sauce. All right. Okay. That folds it. That lowers it, right? No, wait. Are we lowering the front end? Oh, for blazes sakes. Lower additional tank? No, I want to lower the sewer. Fold sewer, turn on sewer, open cover. Oh, wait. <laughs> wow. Turn on the sewer and a what? I know it's reserved for contract work. That's why I'm on this field. Silly game. Oh my gravy. I did cheekily try that. My very first uh, test out in Farm Sim 19. I was like, let me take a contract with this really big piece of equipment and see if I can use it on my own field. No. <laughs> it's like, don't. Now, once we do this contract work, we'll make a little bit of money back. Be a little bit closer to, to, to something. And I'm kind of... Rusher's going to cringe. I'm kind of thinking we should do some forestry because that'll make us some money. Oh, for cripe's sakes. Wolfman or Doss, do you mind murdering that clown? Thank you. <sighs> People. Um, yeah, so I was kind of thinking forestry, but maybe not. Thank you, Das. I don't know whether she heard me in her headset or heard me upstairs. <laughs> But we could cut down a few trees. Haul them to market. Maybe make some money. But I don't know if it would actually cover our, our, our uh, introduction cost. Because we'd have to buy a chainsaw, we'd have to buy a loading unit, we'd have to we'd have to rent a bigger tractor. No, suddenly it's not making sense in terms of money. I want to hit this tree, which I'm probably going to do anyway. I'm like Tarzan. Watch out for that tree. Dunk. Nope, we missed it. Woohoo! See, one loop around the field burned us for about 200. Oh, that's true. I could do that. Cheap and cheerful trailer. I don't know if it's going to sell for enough, though. There's only one way to find out. 
put a grand into a chainsaw and a, probably about a grand into a cheap and cheerful trailer our little 45 horsepower tractor can haul. We'll go ahead and go into an outside, nope, an outside view. Get rid of that F1. And zoom out so we can actually see what we're doing. Woohoo! All right. We got a field to sow. And not a lot of tractor to do it with, but whatever. We're making five, we're making, let's just call it five and a half on this field. I guess my question is, does it make enough sense that maybe we um, maybe we hire a worker to run this while we go do something else? Wood chips are worthless, but full logs are worth it. Okay, I mean we could, yeah. I wonder how much a worker would cost me. Pretty big field. I fear we're going to have to go back for more seed, which is going to be annoying, but you got to do what you got to do. Because if I hired the worker to do it, we went and did trees. That's like subcontracting the contract, right? <laughs> Logs are full of wood chips. That's true. It's all about the packaging. All right, Doss. Silliness. Don't make me break out the banana joke. Anybody who has heard that horrible, horrible joke in Bus Simulator, I actually used it at work. Most people didn't know who Beethoven was, which is which is a different, you know, statement about the state of humanity, but still. I tried. I tried to make a funny and they were all just like, I don't get it. Who's Beethoven? What's that have to do with Beethoven? It's like, oh, good grief. I kind of want to make this farm like small but mighty, you know? I don't want a lot of fields because that's just a lot of work. Um, oi, composer of the dog. Um, I kind of want to make this, this farm like small but mighty in, the, in respect of like, we make a lot of money, but um, But without doing a whole lot of field work. Field work is all well and good, mind you, but it's not, um, it takes a while. <laughs> I do like the turning radius on this tractor. Jeez, if my truck had that turning radius, I'd actually be able to make it around a corner. Steam, how's it going? Uh, all right, fine, y'all asked for it. What's Beethoven's favorite fruit? The banana na na There you go. Now you know. How were the trains, Steam? The more you know, exactly. Did you spat anything? Did you fail a mission at the last second like I did? 
<laughs> I came in. I came into a um, Munich station about 40 miles an hour, 40 kilometers an hour too fast in the ice train, and that thing is an absolute pig to stop. And I went from maybe I'll pass to yeah, nope, I'm now way, way, way not going to pass. <laughs> All I got to say is American coal trains with a hundred coal cars stop better than a ice train. You would think that, Rusher. Fast train, really good brakes, but no. Like, just to get the, the silly thing to stop from like 20 kilometers an hour, I had to give it like 80% brake application. I was like, that is so illogical in my mind. All good till something happened. Yeah, it's pretty much how everything is. <laughs> so I'm using a bunch of mods that Brew put in his game. And on the right, bottom right-hand corner of my screen, over my little avatar there, there's a bunch of values and I honestly have no idea what any of the values mean I'm like they, they're numbers they change in uh, I have no idea what any of that means like why is the tractor say 21.1 percent and the sower is 22.7 percent what does that mean I've sort of figured out that the right hand side of that the number that's jumping around that's my fuel burn I think I'm sure you will hear before long okay steam <laughs> damage percentage how can I have a 20% damage rating like, what have I done to this tractor how did I damage the tank 20% the sower 22% yeah Giants is evil I'm just like why how did I do that? Like I could understand if I was driving like a, like a, I don't know, old tractor and went bouncing over the countryside. You're, you're going to lose like a fender or a steering rack or something, but that the brand new tractor. Insanity, I tell you. Kind of makes me want to watch back on the VOD and see when that number jumped. But probably not. <laughs> to be honest, probably not. Now I'm watching the damage percentage like a hawk and being like, when are you going to roll up another percentage point? I got fuel... I guess that's another damage indicator right underneath there. Um, speed, cruise control, how many hours the tractor has. Okay, so it's got a 58 hour tractor. They use used tractors. Oh, okay, that makes sense, Soren. That makes sense. I wish I could buy used tractors. That would be nice. <laughs> Tired of buying this brand new equipment for buku money. We're actually going to do okay, I think. I think we'll be able to do it in a single bag of seed, which will be nice. That'll be, that'll be a nice... Uh, a nice plus for us. We only had to buy one bag of seed instead of more. Good thing I didn't buy more. If we run out before the mission ends, we'll we'll use the seed we have back at the farm. Just call it a day.
I haven't really thought of an end, an end game for old steam, old stream farms here. Um, I probably need to think of an end game, like a, a thing we want to buy or a thing we want to own or a amount of money we want to make. We'll figure it out, I'm sure. We'll figure it out or make it up, one or the other. Windmill endgame with biggest field. Um, we could. Though I think the windmill is too easy to get. It's only a million. Though with biggest field. Yeah, Russia doesn't believe I can save my money, that's why. Russia's like, he'll never be able to save that kind of money. He'll always just spend it, which, I mean, I mean, not necessarily wrong, mind you, but... Like our, like our seeds are going down quicker than they were before, but maybe I'm just crazy. Um, that's true, Rusher. That's true. We are using seasons, so it does make it more difficult. Eh, we'll see. Let's let's start with that. We can modify it later. So let's start with. We want to get a windmill and run the largest field. Magic birds just appeared out of nowhere. Oh my goodness, this field. We'll, we'll be there. We'll get there eventually. What are we doing? About 2% per row. So I'm thinking I'm going to be down around 14% when we clear off this row. So it gives me about seven more runs. Should make it. I hope so. I mean, otherwise, push comes to shove. We're just going to um, grab seed out of our farm because whatever. 14%. God, I still can't get over the turning radius of this tractor. It's just ridiculous. Ridiculously good. Given for me to turn my truck around like that, I'd end up doing a, an Austin Powers three-point turn maneuver. Turn a three-point turn into a 9,000-point turn. Oh, look, this guy's got weeds in his uh, field already. Oh, I bet you we're going to have weeds in our field. So we're going to have to go ahead and plan to, to, to get the, um, the sprayer, the, the, the one with the, the thin wheels so that we don't destroy our crop and start spraying our fields. Darn it, we're gonna we're gonna have good crop. I don't care about this guy's field, but our field's gonna be good. The JCB fast track in the medium tractor section has four wheel steering. Oh, that is magical. That is almost that I bet you that's almost as good as the tracked one where you can just break a, an entire track and basically turn on the midsection of the track.
kind of thinking once grass grows, guys, we'll we'll buy the sheep. Wait, do we need to wait? Do we need to wait for that grass to grow to buy the sheep, or will the sheep eat grass in their field with seasons? They should eat the grass in their field, right? If the cows eat the gra grass in their field, what did I do? Oh, I don't want a hired worker. Stop it. Somehow I hired a worker, but whatever. Oh, man. Come on, now. There. Um, I have no idea what's going on outside my window, but it sounds like a bunch of dogs barking or some people screaming at dogs that are barking. Uh, all right. Well, may we hopefully we'll make this, then we'll go and we'll turn in our contract. We'll check on our fields to see if we have any weeds popping. If we do, we'll go get this. We'll go rent the uh, the sprayer to go spray our fields, and then then we'll we'll investigate a. Nope. <sighs> Darn it! Stop it! Stupid game. <laughs> Stop magically hiring a worker. I don't know what button I'm pressing to hire these workers. Oh, it must not be registering the left bumper. Which makes sense with my janky as crap Xbox controller I'm using. Oh my goodness. Why does it look like I didn't seed that part? I went around the field at least once. Oh man. Silly game. I don't think we're gonna make it, guys. I only I think we're gonna have to go get more seed. I think we'll be down to eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Maybe it's going to be tight if we make this. I really would like to because I really don't want to go get more seed. Look at that, we plowed over the the weeds that was growing. Oh well, they're gone now. Magic birds. Now I'm I'm being very, very deliberate that I've got the uh the left bumper completely pressed before I uh press the button to drop the uh sower. Trying to take as big of a swath as I can here. Because I don't want to spend any more time than we need to doing this other guy's field. Because, meh. Not our field, not our problem. We just want his monies. Give me your money, man. Give me your sewing money. Yeah, I think we got. I think we got a plan, guys. I think we got a plan. I think it's a Russia-approved plan, and if it's not, at some point, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> if the season's mine, nah, that's all right. We'll figure it out. I'm sure you'll just read it and tell me what to do. <laughs> I mean, I guess the question is, did we get an qu answer to that? Yeah, I guess the question is the sheep. Will they eat grass in their pen during the, the spring and summer? I would think they would. 
Otherwise, we're just going to have to wait till late spring to buy the cows. And we're going to wait on buying the chickens, I think. This is going to be so close whether we make this or not. Please, little sower, be conservative. Amount of animals in the time of year. Okay. Well, hopefully we get this. We, we will do it right. We're going we're gonna to take a flyer on sheep here soon. see what we can get on the sheepage we're not going to be sheepish about it though we don't want to pull the wool over our eyes that would be bad for business if we had goats we could kid around I'll stop. I won't really, but we'll we'll stop for now on those. There's some maps that have goats. Uh, we're gonna be. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna make this. Maybe they, maybe it'll be nice enough that we'll finish enough the contract to be able to call it good. Doubt it, but we'll try. We'll try and see what we can get. Hopefully everyone's having a good Friday. Getting ready for a nice weekend. I spent my day cleaning my shop. So now I can actually use it because I actually have found my workbench, which is questionable whether I'd ever find it again. Um, and yeah, I've, I've got wood in places now. I know kind of what I have in terms of sizes so I can actually start working on some projects again. Unfortunately, that means pulling all the vehicles out of the garage so they don't get covered in sawdust, but. Or finding a big enough uh, sheet or something to cover the one car. If I, could, if I could get away with just pulling out Doss's car, that would make my life easier, but. Right now, I got both cars in there and I can't. I can't get have them covered in sawdust. That would just not work, so. Yep, we're going to have to go and get more seed, I think. Unfortunate as that might be. Well, we'll, we'll check if, if they're going to accept it when we run out here. The nice thing is now that I got my shop reclaimed or my workbench reclaimed, I can take apart a couple of electronic equipment that I have out there that's been sitting, waiting, until I could find my workbench. Um, and I still got to finish taking the Lego apart in the basement. And we're out. Wait. Oh, no, we're not out. We have 18 more. 17, 16, 15, 14... 12, 11, 10, okay, let's lift and see how much more we got, oh, so close, so close, all right, uh, that. we're going to have to go and use the seed that we got at our farm.
wow, this tractor is um, is a bit challenged with the um, the weight on the back of it. Well, I mean, at least the nice thing is to drive back to the farm will give us some chance to kind of take a gander. Look at these trees here, guys. I think this is where we this is where we come to start our uh, lumberjack business, lumberjack trade. We'll uh, we'll work up in there for a while on the uh, the trees. Oh, hey, watch out there! See what we can make in terms of money there. A wage payment of three dollars. Who the heck did I pay three dollars to? Oh, I almost turned there, but that's not our farm. Somewhere right about there. Yep. <laughs> I was like, I can't see for the trees, but I'm going to guess that I can fit there. Oh, no, wait. It's, we fill from the front. We'll just go ahead and we'll just go ahead and fill it. We don't need all that, but it's fine. Because then I can actually move it <laughs> somewhere else, I hope. All right, I need to get inside the tractor so I can actually see without these trees in my face. Trees in my face. Oh, when I hired the worker back. Oh, man, he charged me $3 for doing nothing? Ugh, typical worker. It's, it's like the people I work with will bill a client we're not going to do any work. We're just going to bill them. Okay. I wish life worked like that. I'd have some bills for some of my uh, companies I work for, worked for. All right. Let's get this field done and dusted so we can rock and roll with some tree cutting, making some money. Unfortunately, it doesn't mean we have to drive back to the farm before we can claim the, uh, the uh, contract so that we can unload. All right. Uh, a. Get out of the tractor. I can see better. Lower. And turn on. All right. Let's get her done. We were so close. And yet, so far away. I did see somebody working. Oh, good grief. I did see somebody, uh, Ra, um, Summerlin Farm. I saw him working the GPS mod, or the GPS on these tractors. And I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. I don't know how to do it, mind you, but. If you leave the seed in the planter, it'll be get sold and you, oh, sweet. Then we're gonna be doing that because I'd rather not have to deal with the seed. Does he have a cow roof? No, it's just black and white. Okay. Wasn't that, um, that was the pre-order bonus for one of these ones. Uh, 13, I want to say. Maybe it was 15. Maybe it was 17. I can't remember. One of them, you got the cow Voltra. I don't think I ever used that, that thing, but eh, whatever. Contract on field 16 finished. Really? All right. Well, that's cool. We'll be stopping then. Off. Lift. Bold. All right. So now, uh, do we want to hop out? No, we don't. I don't care if we stay here. Yes. Collect. 
Woohoo! We got some money! Some money, money, money! Alright. Now, now, we start by buying ourselves a chainsaw. Ooh, which chainsaw do we want? Uh, I don't really care, so we're going to go with this one. Yep, I know. All right, now we need to check out for trailers. We're looking for cheap and cheerful. Well, there's that one. That one's definitely cheap and cheerful. Um, oh, big fields. Yeah, well, we weren't going to be there for a while. We got that one, which is actually smaller. Interesting. What else do we have? Well, there's a three-ton tipper for 650 bucks. That might be a good one to throw on our tractor. What are you? A lizard car trailer for 3,500. Well, I'm thinking. I'm leaning, guys. I'm leaning. Ooh, where'd it go? What about the three-ton tractor uh, trailer tipper? Capacity 3,000. <laughs> Look at that. So we had a lot of weight on the back. Ooh, we can get a bail wagon. Uh huh. So it's gonna cost us six hundred fifty bucks. You approve the three ton. <laughs> All right, let's buy it. All right. Time to run back to the farm. Grab our uh, thing. Oh man, look at this guy. He he. Oh, it's withered. I was like, he planted cotton without plowing or liming. Nope, it's withered. Never mind. Previously, it had cereal on it. I wonder what kind of cereal. Lucky Charms, maybe. Fruit Loops. Imagine. I'm going to grow Fruit Loops in my field. I bet you if you said that to some people, they would actually believe you grow Fruit Loops and Lucky Charms and Apple Jacks. The same people who don't know that carrots come from farms and think that carrots just come from grocery stores. Green Day, how's it going? How's it going? All right, field does not have a single weed upon it, so we are good. And that field up there, I'm hoping, has not a single weed upon it too, which would be nice. All right, let's... Uh, there we go. I heard it finish going down. So now, go. We got rid of the brony. All right, let's roll. We're going to go run up this way just to make sure this field is okay. I thought that was weeds. Nope, it's birds. <laughs> All right, that field looks good. I think we're gonna be okay for a while. We'll, we'll come by and check every day or so. Maybe make it our, our daily task once a day to come by and check. I don't wanna, I don't wanna spray the field until I absolutely have to. The first sign of weeds, we spray. But until then, we're gonna try to, try to make do. Yeah, I can go away for right now. So we'll go and grab the uh, the three-ton trailer that we just bought for 650 bucks, and we're gonna go lumber lumberjacking. It's the, not the verb to use there, but it's the verb we have used. We'll wait till late spring, and then late spring, I think, we'll aim to get sheep. And cows, maybe? And... Kind of thinking that... Yeah, I mean, that's really what we got to do. We just, we're just going to have to kind of... Uh, 
uh, God, what did my grandpa say about stuff like that? Um, not piddle. Uh, not muddle. Not goof around, but it sort of meant goof around. It was one of those 1940s, 1950s terms. Um, don't forget your fancy lumberjack helmet. Wait, never mind. Fancy lumberjack helmet is not in the budget. <laughs> Thanks, Rusher. Appreciate it. We store. We apparently are storing our lime here, for reasons. Okay, we are all hooked up and ready to roll. All right. Now that that word is going to bug me for a while now. It's like you know you 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 don't have a lot to do because like. The, the major tasks are done and you're just waiting for the next task you know is going to come about so you go and you just kind of do a bunch of like individual little things here and there ah what was the word he used I can't remember now because we do stuff like um, uh, do stuff like use the go take the scythe and um and and scythe the weeds off the top of the strawberry crop so we could get down there and get the strawberries or um, straighten out nails. Hodge, how's it going? Oof, green day. That's that's unfortunate. I'm sorry to hear about your grandma dying. Um, hopefully she lived a long and fruitful life and all of that. I know it's not much of a condolence in that term, but in the grand scheme of things, it's probably the best I got. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I, I understand all, all four of my grandparents have passed, so. 73, I mean, that's not a terrible age to go. I don't know how old my grandparents were. Hodge, how was the stream? I think you, I think I saw you were streaming. Wait, were you streaming today? I don't remember who was streaming today. All very confused. Look at the clouds. Look at how they're like streaming across. We actually see that here in Colorado from time to time. It's pretty cool. All right, we're gonna go lumberjacking. Uh, I don't want to turn there. I want to go up here, I think. I turned off my map on purpose to see if I could remember how to get back. <laughs> no, it's kind of thinking that was a bad idea, but we'll see. That leads into a field. Ah, there is a road up here. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Here it is. Okay, we're good. Think. Take this road. Yeah, buddy. Kind of ran out of steam. Well, you got to put more coal on it there, Hodge. Put more coal on the engine. Okay, we are arriving, I th think, near the lumber mill. Aha! Indeed we have. Well, look at us. We are at the lumber mill. Okay, good. We're going to go and cut down these trees because they're nice and close. Also, I'm lazy. Nope, nope. Get on that tractor. We will not burn fuel if we don't have to, because bad idea. All right, which tree are we gonna? We're gonna start with this tree over here. Uh, I, I honestly have. I'm gonna have to do that. Whoop! Come on now, game. Okay. Have to do this this way. You don't have access to this land. No. <laughs> Boink. All right, 
Let's see what we got to do. Oi, stop it, game. Where are we? Aha. Yeah, but that's... No idea what that is. Uh, uh, X, Gibbon. Oh, no, it is. You do have to buy it. Uh, of course you do. Okay, that's going to be interesting. I don't think we have any trees on our land. So... No, I think we do have some trees. Let's go see what we can lumberjack in our yard. <laughs> yeah. That's a tree. Found a tree. I mean, in the end, we kind of needed this trailer anyway when we do our harvest. So it's not like it's a wasted 650 bucks. And also it'll allow us to haul all kinds of other things. So not terrible. I would have I would have I would have preferred I would have preferred that we uh you know could have used some tree cutting, but yeah. Um Yeah, I know, I've seen that mod. I swear I had it in the game, but um, barely not. So, there you go. We'll look for that mod, because I think we're going to have to lease land. But it wasn't it wasn't a terrible thing to have to go and get this trailer anyway, because, like I said, we were going to need it eventually. Left control G? What? Oh. Oh, that's factories. What's this? No. No. Field lease. Ah, I see. So I'd have to know the field number. So it goes up to 37. So, thirty-six. Does that make? Does that mean that this is thirty? Well, that's twenty-six. So that has to be thirty. Okay, so that's thirty-five. So that one has to be thirty-seven. Six point eight. Yeah. How's the tractor? Um, <laughs> underpowered. Um, let's let's think about the lease because uh, I don't know. I'm kind of not sold on the leasing. Um, we we did go and and rent ourselves a uh, a more powerful tractor so that we could actually do our seeding. But we've seeded and it is 4:30 p.m. in game, so not terrible. Right. Okay. So um, it, what was it? Alt S. So we're on the second day here, so we'll be mid-spring here in a couple days. That'll be good. Um, what's our weather forecast? Today, Wednesday, it looks like we got rain in the middle of, uh, rain in the midnight, and then rain in the afternoon into the evening. Okay, cool. And then, uh, whatever. And then the cow pasture. Large sheep pasture, large cow, and horse paddock. So we really need to think about, we, we should think about water. So let's look at water. Universal tank pack. Seven grand. Ouch. <sighs> 7,000 for that tank. wonder if that wouldn't put my tractor on its butt. Um, where is the other water? It's, it's in Misk, I think. Maybe not. Um, hmm. What in the world is that? Drive laner. Don't know what that is. Uh, gosh, all the stuff that brew has in here. <laughs> A shovel? Well, how about them apples? 
This machine you can clean dirty. I don't want that. Oh, we can have a wrecker. Let's not. Water tank is in animals. Animals! That would make sense, wouldn't it? 9,000! Oh my goodness, we'd be better off getting the multi-tank. 25,000. 8,000. Yeah. And that's eight grand. It'd be eight thousand liters. What does the universal tank gonna cost me? Honestly, we'd be better off getting the universal tank. Because it's cheaper overall. Then we'd be ready for the animals or we just wait until we need it. Kind of thinking I might wait till we need. What do you guys think? Should we prep for the animals by getting the, getting the water tank, going ahead and filling up their water in the sheep and the cow pan? Cause we know we're gonna get sheeps and sheeps. Eh, sheeps and cows, sheep and cows, or do we just wait? Because we could technically probably lease that, but the least cost would probably eat us up pretty quick. Ah, tasty, tasty. Um, let's see here. While we're thinking about that. I wanted to go to here because I want to see if I can't turn off. Nope, I think it's over here. Nope, it's got to be here. If I can turn off. Aha. If I can turn that to there. Let's see if I can drive this tractor with the keyboard because the honestly, as much as I don't mind the controller. Oh, that's so much better. Okay. I like that. Okay. Now, now I can use just the keyboard. Perfect. Got that fixed. <laughs> What is this? Oh, that's our chicken pen. Oh, that's so cute. I can't get in there. Oh, there we go. So chickens. All right, let's turn that on. Let me see. Left alt one. Oh, that completely kills the HUD. Cool. Hand tools. Right. Oh, animal dialogue. Right. I can order the chickens. Right. Um, atypical, it's, it depends because I have so many mods in the game. Um, having the full keyboard is so much nicer. I will say driving is usually easier with the controller, but the switch between the two, the problem is the help menu never updates in time. So it kind of is a pain in the pain in the tail. Um, okay. And also I've been playing with the keyboard since farm sim 13 13 11 I don't remember way back when way back in the day um okay let's let's figure out what we're doing here is the vanilla game worth it well the nice thing is the vanilla game has mod hub so not all the mods I have are on mod hub but a number of them are um, and you don't need a premium pack for Mod Hub. So if you're thinking about it, uh, well, let me ask you this. PC, PS4, or Xbox? Which one would you buy it on? Uh, well, while I'm uh, waiting on your answer, PC, okay. Um, yeah, then the vanilla, I'd, I'd honestly look for a deal. If you don't mind the Epic Games Store, you usually can get $10 off on the Epic Store. 
So you can always do that. Oops. We'll just get ourselves into the night, into the late enough that we can sleep through the night. It's fourteen ninety nine on Steam. Yeah, I mean that's. I'd I'd still look at the Epic Game Store just to see if you can get it for um, a discount because they. Hodge, if you're if Hodge is in the the chat, he might be able to tell you about his. I think he got Snowrunner for ten dollars off or something like that. I don't, I don't fully understand what the Epic Game Store is doing, even though I, I use it from time to time. But yeah, I think it's worth it to get if you don't mind the game. All right, now I need to remember how to sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Next hand, show hand map size. Oop, is that my sleepy? Oh, there, right. Yep, no, those are lights. Where's the sleep? Oh, there it is. Uh, what was it, 1800? Yeah, 1800. Oh, come on now. What is that, 18, 19, 20? That's uh, 22, that's midnight. Two, four, six. We're going to sleep for 13 hours. <laughs> All right, next morning, let's see, we got, um, whoa, why were we charged 17 grand of vehicle lease costs? What? 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 Hmm. Yeah, see if, see if you can get the $10 voucher in the Epic Store. Because if you could, then you could get the game for like four ninety nine, and then yeah, get it all day long. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, I guess that was total cost. All right. So construction costs were a grand. New vehicles. Vehicle running cost was zeroed out. Property maintenance seventy seven. We had seed and fertilizer costs. We made five grand in contracts. We paid some in wages. So we lost eighteen grand yesterday. That's not terrible for having to basically put our farm together from scratch. Um, okay. But it does make me think. Well, all right, so first things first, let's, let's see what our, um, let's see what our fields are doing. If we got any weedage, probably not, because it's only been one day. But we might as well look and see how we doing. Fertilized, 66%. Really? Whatever game. Whatever. All right. Field four and field six are switching back and forth. It's kind of funny. All right. Um, that's clear. Charges me, but gives me the... Okay. Thank you, Rusher. I was like, oh my gosh, they double charged me. Those jerks. But okay. Um, hey, look at that. We got grass, sort of. <laughs> we got some grass. Good for us. All right. So we'll have grass soon. We're really kind of in a holding pattern, I feel. We got to do something for money. Um, that's not the button I wanted. I wanted this one to see what contracts are out there. A transporting contract. Really? From the transport company to the gas station. I probably need something with a front loader for that, and I'm not even going to bother. Otherwise, if I could pick it up, I could pick it up and toss it in the trailer here. Um, but I'm betting we can't do that. So, Let's see what we can do in terms of making money on the cheap. Uh, let's see here. We have not much. I mean, we got the bee houses. They're making us $8 an hour. So 160 and something. Wait, did we actually get, did we actually get that money? 
Yeah, we had 170. Today, 74, right? Because we waited partway through the day. Um, so we're already covering our property maintenance. Right. Great. We're not going to buy new vehicles. We're not going to. We might build something, but I don't know. I don't really want to lease anything. Um, we won't get more seeds or fertilizer. We're not going to hire anybody. So I think we're going to make money in this day, in this one day. I kind of wonder if we don't jump the day. So much easier to jump a day in uh, Farmer's Dynasty, honestly. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll, we'll kind of wait and see what kind of contracts come up because this transporting contract, or should I try the transporting contract? What do you guys think? You think I'll be able to do the transporting contract with just a trailer? Or do you think I'd have to have a front loader? I wish I'd tell you the what exactly you're picking up. Thank you for following, Miss Vay. How's it going? Uh, I also wish that these tomatoes here um, would give me some money. That would be amazing. All right, you think he, I think you need a front loader. I think you're right, Rusher. I think we're kind of in a pattern of waiting. Kind of want another contract to show. So let's... Nope. It would be helpful if I could get some movement on that. Let's just... just just not, not screw around here. Let's just make it 120 times speed. Excellent. Good to hear, Miss Vay. Glad you're doing well. Welcome to Old Stream Farms, where um, uh, my business manager, Rusher, is uh, trying to keep a strong paw down on my uh, spending habits. <laughs> Best front loader and trailer. Okay. And then we can't put a front loader on our tractor because it's a whole 45 horsepower. And if we put a front loader on it, it would probably explode in flames. All right. Now, do we have more contracts? We do. Transporting. Excellent. Great demand. It's a spinnery. Well, they're SOL today because we ain't got nothing for them. I mean, I could give them a broom or a pallet. Tractor tires. Ah. Huh. Ooh, I wonder if I shouldn't. Eh, nah. Uh, all right. We got anything else? No. Depends on if you have the mod to let you pick up heavier objects. Uh, probably not. <laughs> Seasons has a lot of waiting if you don't have animals. Yeah, I kind of knew that. It's just really tempted, guys. I'm really tempted. I mean, I know Rusher's there, but, you know, we could. No, we can't buy that. Maybe, maybe. How about this? We could, we could buy this. It's only 5,900 bucks. It looks like the derpiest thing in the world, but 5,900 bucks, we'd make 1,800 of it back almost right away. We're doing it. If we want the animals, we'll need the loader. Yeah, that's true. You're right. We will. You know what? If we're going to get the animals, though, we need to go quality over cheapitude. So, should we get the, I mean, quality. Quality is a relative term. No cheap. <laughs> <laughs> We'll get a three. Ew. We get ourselves a uh, a three five six, a Massey Ferguson three five 
six. That's a horrid looking machine, but let's buy it. Yes. And we're gonna need a front loader, skid steer loader. Is there something special for the Massey, I wonder? Oh my good googly moogly. All right, pallet fork. Wow, look at all that, okay. Pallet fork, 600 bucks. Yeah. All right, so it cost us $6,500. It's now raining. But I think, I think we'll, uh, oh, let's check our contracts again. They're still both there. We're gonna go ahead and real time it because you're right, train man. If we accelerate the speed, we're just gonna end up losing the contracts. I'm gonna pick up the $800 one first because I bet you it's a shorter distance. And we're gonna try to run it without, because our trailer, of course, is not equipped to handle f flatbed loads, because of course it isn't. We're gonna just try the old, just drive it there with the skid steer model. See, this is where in Farmer's Dynasty, you'd end up looking for uh, mushrooms or fishing or using the weed eater to clean all the the grass out of your yard or uh, planting a garden. <laughs> I think you guys are gonna be pleasantly surprised with the, the progress we've made in Farmer's Dynasty tomorrow. All right, that is one derpy looking loader, but you know what, that's fine. All right, and let's go ahead and take our lime. Thought for a second it said train spotting contracts. <laughs> yeah, I would have called shenanigans on that one too. Shenanigans. Okay, well now that we got this thing, let's go ahead and uh, we were gonna get this one first. Let's get in our tractor. Wow, this is a this is a track. This is a this is a thing. We're doing it. It's a thing. All right. Yellow is pick up and red is drop off. So that's not going to be a terrible little run. You can only go 12 miles an hour, but that's all right. I'm going to get there, and there's going to be like six containers, aren't I? Uh, okay guys, remind me. Enable to a height reset, no, toggle, bah. It's like, where is cruise control? Never mind, found it. <laughs> uh, I think this thing has a hitch, really? Holy moly, it's got something. I don't know if it's a hitch hitch, it's a pin hitch. Might work with our trailer, but our trailer isn't designed to take flat goods. But it's never stopped us before. Guess we could turn on the beacon, eh? Take the sides off the three ton. Don't we have to pay to take the sides off the three ton, though, Rusher? <laughs> oh, wait, maybe we don't. Well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. We 
got to get to the farm first. I'm just looking to see if there's weeds. Nope, that is one heck of a slope, though. You don't realize how bad that slope really is until you start looking at it. You're like, whoa. I don't know if I'd want to go sideways on that slope very much in real life. Not with that that tractor that we've got. <laughs> Definitely not with this thing. We'd end up rolling it. Be faster ground. Yeah, I would think so. I think it would. I think in real life, I would have swapped the grass and the uh, canola fields around. We would have been running canola down in that flat, and that would have just been pasture land or grassland. Okay, now the beacon annoys me. Alright, we're going to see if we can hook up to our trailer that we bought. Wow, this thing has no brakes, but that's, that's alright. We don't need no, we don't need no stinking brakes. I don't know if it's going to work though. That does, I don't think this thing, oh no, maybe it was pin hitched. Yep, it uh, looks like it. Let's find out. Oh, yep, we can. All right, let's go. See what we can do about the sides on this thing. Fuel for is perfect to use the fancy new DLC. Yeah, that new DLC. I I honestly haven't looked at it. I'm like I I I, I, uh. <laughs> I can barely figure out what I'm doing half the time in this. All right, let's see what we can do here. Oh, what button is it? R. R. Uh, no, the other one. How are you picking up that one but not that one? There we go. Customize. There we go. Customize. Yes. Sweet! Good call there, Rusher. Surprised that Rusher knows what he's doing and I don't? Nope, nobody's surprised by that. Alright, here we go. Let's go get our our load of whatever from wherever and take it to wherever so we can get our 800 bucks. I still say we should have gotten the more expensive one. Would have been more fun. Go up here. Okay, yeah. Nice short drive. Would have been slower. <laughs> true. Actually, very true. I think I posted a picture in my Discord um, where I <clears throat> in a, I did a transport mission and I took a big long trailer. I had it hooked to a truck and I took a skid steer on the trailer and then I loaded the the pallets onto the front of the trailer and put the skid steer on the back of the trailer. Yeah, things didn't go exactly as planned. Let's just say that. I mean, everything was fine until the whole I had to unstrap it. Yeah, I got gianted pretty much. Yeah, once I unstrapped it, everything went a little bit hay haywire. Nope, let's not destroy their luggage. Why would you put your lug? Oh, okay, you know what? I don't. I'm not going to judge these people and their uh, their habits. Eh, I'm going to try to push my trailer a little bit. It's my trailer. I can do whatever I want to it. <laughs> That's what I'm going with. Okay. 
wait. Okay, grief, help, go away. I don't need your help, help thing. Yeah, as soon as I released the straps on the um, on the things that I put on the the trailer that I took the picture of, um, I had space bales or space pallets or whatever they were. It's uh, it's quite entertaining. It wasn't so entertaining to go find them and get them in the right location, but you know, what do you do? What do you do? Oh, that is not going to work. This is where this is where the controller might have been a better choice, honestly. There we go. All right. Before we do anything else, wait. Where is that? Let's get these things strapped down. I'm not going to lose them off the back. All right. Let's boogie. We'll make our 800 bucks. That'll pay for our pallet fork <laughs> and put $200 towards the cost of our of our front loader. Skid steer. Not even a skid steer. Tail steer. I'm going to call it a tail steer now. See, this makes me think I should buy a truck. <laughs> Drusher's like, no! <laughs> I can hear it. I can hear it all the way from Dakota. Case, how's it going? How's it going? Um, you missed us by uh, renting a big old case to do our field seating, but I think this is a... No, that's a Massey. Eh, never mind. <laughs> mm, we, had to, we had to rent a big old case to do the field seating since our, our sad little 30, 45 horsepower tractor couldn't do diddly. Um, all right, where are we going? The grocery store. Where's the grocery store? Where are we delivering this? Where are we going? Okay, game. You got to give me better clues than this. Oh, right there. Aha. Feeding the cows. Ah, we don't have cows yet. <laughs> but we do have this silly little uh, front loader thing. I want to try if I can pick up one of these. Ah, uh, nope. All right, let's see. What happened? Oh, I hit a thing. Let's try not hitting the thing now. So some people, these must be like executives or something who came in to work at the, uh, or maybe maybe not executives, maybe, uh, well, why are we delivering this at the grocery store? I don't understand that. Dude, really? Seriously? All right, whatever. Excuse me, lady. Okay, there we go. Look at us being all being all precise and whatever. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to buy build buy build build buy whatever. Um, a couple more bee houses just to be sure that we have enough money to cover all of our running costs. But we'll see. We'll see after today what our running costs are and whether the bee houses cover the running cost. Because I really would like the bee houses to do most of that, at least initially. Nope. There we go. 
Woohoo! Sir, quit walking through the middle of my tractor, please. Yeah! Collected! <sighs> Alright, accept the contract. If you didn't have so many games to play, you could play Farming Simulator N64 Edition. No, thank you. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, that's the shop shop. The shop shop, as opposed to the not quite shop shop. Uh, oh, uh, Case, we, uh, we did give you a car last night in Car Mechanic. You've, you've got a car. Um... Good luck with it. Uh, that's all I'm going to say. Good luck. <laughs> and last night was... Um, you're not playing Delivery Simulator, right? It does feel a little bit like that. Uh, I think this gets me over there. Wait, this puts me in the wrong... Oh, fudge. Yeah, no, this is wrong. Good thing we can turn around on a dime. Eh, yeah, it was more of a quarter. And then after we gave Case his car in Car Mechanic Simulator, we then spent all of our money, which we, we, yeah. Do not enter. Well, I'm entering anyway, because I'm very confused. Where in the world am I and where am I going? Oh, this is the right way. I gotta go past the animal dealer, right? Yeah, we're going this way. <laughs> Don't mind us, just going the wrong way. So next week, um, I'm going to, on Thursdays, we're going to play something other than Car Mechanic Simulator. Um, we're kind of, kind of running up against the end of that one. So we'll play something else. Tomorrow we're going to be in Farmer's Dynasty. I've been working in Farmer's Dynasty. I've been doing a lot of work so that y'all don't have to watch me do all of that work. Um, you'll just drop a 5.9 liter Cummings in it. I doubt it, Case. Um, right when Dara's lost. Mechanic, that's it. All the time. <laughs> Case, it's it's not a truck. Um it's very much not a truck. It, it might be a Miata with a twin turbo V8 in it. But, I mean, it might, it might not be, but it probably is. Um, uh, but tomorrow we're going to do, we, we've got Farmer's Dynasty. I've been doing a lot of work in Farmer's Dynasty. Uh, I don't think that this is where I'm supposed to go. Thank you for following Emerson. Uh, Emerson. <laughs> Welcome to Old Stream Farms. We are going. We are. We are playing Delivery Simulator in Farming Simulator because we we need monies. We need monies, and we're not allowed to have a lot because Russia won't let us have expensive equipment. So we have a El Cheapo trailer and a El Cheapo. I'm gonna call it a skid steer, a tail steer. So. Great demand at Selling Station 2! Well, that's nice, but I have nothing to sell, so... Not really, not really mattering to me, none. Oop, there we go. And there we go, look at that, perfect. You'll find a way. Ah, okay. Well, it's uh, it's definitely an inter. It will be an interesting vehicle for you to do, to uh, do any kind of farm work in. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of leaning towards um, on Thursday playing. Um, Um, 
airport CEO, because, yeah. Ah, come on now, giants. Let me have my pallet going down. Oh, no, not there. Yes, yes, everyone saw what happens when, when Russia isn't around to control the money. Oh, for goodness sakes. All right, I obviously have the pallet tipped back. Oi, giants. There. <laughs> I mean, we did we did okay mechanic. I mean, we bought what like fifty cars that I now have to play with and ah no, not that button. There, wait, 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 safety. Attach all the things. There we go. Sure. I can't pick up the pallets, but I can pick up that entire trailer and move it. We'll take that. We'll take that. All right. <clears throat> so this this will get us a grand. So we'll have eighteen hundred dollars made back on the sixty-five hundred dollar outlay for this skid steer tail steer thing, and the um, go on that side. The game says. All right. Fine. Um, and uh, the tail steer and the, the fork. So we'll, we'll have partially made back our outlay. And really, you know, in the end, if I can partially make back the outlay, it's probably for the best. Uh, it, is one, it is one weird looking tractor, though, I'll tell you what. Well, front skid tail steer thing. It's in the skid steers, but it's not a skid steer. It's a tail steer, but it's weird looking. I mean, I know why they did it. It makes sense in terms of the statics and dynamics engineering loads on it, but wow, it's strange. But I bet you, I bet you this thing can pick a lot more than a standard skid steer. Because you got the engine hanging off the back like that. So you got that counterweight on there. Yeah. Bet you so. So we probably could lift pretty big loads with this guy that we, we wouldn't even dare with a skid steer. Because, like, a. Um, oh, man, what is it? I was lifting something with the skid steer and I was going nose over. trying to remember now it might have been when I was running two bales two big bales I, I think I might have been lifting two big bales or three big bales stacked and um, and I was having trouble with the skid steer it would it would the weight of it once I took it off the trailer would just pull the skid steer right down so Mitch Brew would love. This is probably actually Brew's mod because I'm running all of Brew's mods plus a bunch of my own. You could lift a little car with it. Yeah, you're probably right. I probably could. All right, so this is probably where we're. Yeah, that's where we're delivering. Okay, let's not let's not hit the uh, gas pumps with our forks. That would be a bad idea. I do like the turning radius, though. It's not like skid steer level, but... Oh my gosh, I can't see the blooming thing there. Little pick. Oops. Crash. Oops. Ah! Okay, very tight. <laughs> tight location. Here we go. There's item number one to get get off my forks. Get off my forks. Don't make me use the old tree trick like we did in Farm Sim 13 with bales. <laughs> uh, those were the days when your bales were, were would get stuck on your fork, and so you had to use the old rub it off on a tree, like a ho like a horse or a cow scratching its butt on a barbed wire fence. 
Alright, that's way too much down on that. Boink. There we go. And that should be that contract done. Yep. Collected. Nice. Alright. Go put this puppy up. Was just skid steer story IRL in game. In game. <laughs> Me run a skid steer. Uh, I have, but um, only with a bucket on it. So all I was moving was dirt. And it was sandy dirt from the desert, so it didn't weigh anything anyway. I almost had to, I almost was going to rent a, uh, one of those cool, hey, I'm going here, oi, oi, yeah, um, I almost rented one of those walk behind, like, skid steer things to do some landscaping, but then instead I hired landscapers, because I couldn't be bothered, really. Alright, we have the silliest looking skid steer tail steer thingamajiggy, but we'll, we'll park her up in here because, hey, made money. That's really all that matters, and it is raining, raining, raining in this game. Ever since I started, um, it's been kind of rainy. Alright, we'll just park here because the reality is we're probably going to have to do more um, all right, let's see, no contracts. Here we go. <clears throat> okay. I'm kind of tempted to get the chickens because I can get, um, I can just get like you know, three bags of chicken food or four bag or one or four bags of chicken food if I wanted to. That's more than my trailer cost. <laughs> oh my goodness. Do we have any contracts? No. Probably gonna be out of contracts today. If we can get the mid-spring, what do you think? Buy the sheep mid-spring, maybe? Nope, looks like the rain's letting up. Oh, well, there we go. We got any contracts? No. Be amazing what a skid steers will list. Well, no, that's, I mean, yeah. I'm just thinking, like, from a the perspective of an engineering statics and dynamics lesson, the um, this Massey could probably lift more since the engine is hanging out back so far. So the moment around the lift axis is different than a skid steer because the moment around the lift axis of a skid steer is at the tail end of the skid steer. Now, theoretically, if you move this lift all the way back, you'd have a huge um, lift capacity on that thing. No contracts. Um, but that's just the, in really? That's just the, in the engineering, st former engineering student in me talking right there. Because, <laughs> yeah, that's, basically, if you cut it off right there and stuff the engine underneath it, you'd have a skid steer. Sort of. Oh, looks like we're finally getting dark. We're going to make it to the next day and see. We should be. Um, we should be mid-spring next. So, wait. Ah, her, open. What is it? 1830? Yep. About 12 hours this time. 
Wow, that's just uh, so property maintenance property. Look at that! Woo! We are making money. We're synchronizing after a fast forward. What the? Oh, it's 0600. 0630 technically. Um. All right. So first things first. Contracts. Fertilizing. You need me to fertilize your field? No thanks. You do it yourself. Ha ha. All right, I want to check our money thingy again. So we spent 6,500 bucks. We're definitely good, doing good here. Now I feel better that our bee houses are going to cover our running cost for now. Um, we did make $1,900 in contract income. So we're short, call it 2,000 in contract income. So we're short $4,500. That's not terrible in my mind. Thank you for following the 33 bowl. Uh, welcome to the old stream farm. Uh, so I think we're gonna be good. We at least have a baseline income stream coming in. Uh, I wish we could get a, another couple transport contracts. Cause I think I, I need to do about four grand more worth of con transport contracts to pay off the skid steer. Um, are we mid-spring? We are mid-spring, so I'm thinking it's time to get... Let's turn on a flashlight. Good grief. Um, it's mid-spring. I'm thinking it might be time to go ahead and get the sheep. What do you all think? I don't know if that's a sheep pen. I really don't know. Uh, are you the sheepage? It doesn't look like it. It looks like... Well, maybe. I don't know. I know nothing, apparently. But if we do that, we're gonna have to get the uh, we're gonna have to get the water trailer. Okay. Um. All right, we're gonna have to buy the water trailer because we don't have a ch choice if we're gonna put the sheep in. So the water trailer is gonna set us back. We're doing none but spending money to, to Rusher's constant displeasure. Um, we're going to have to spend $7,600 to get water. I don't need a water trailer? Why not? Why wouldn't I need a water trailer for my, um, for my animals? Look at water troughs. I've got to find the water troughs. Oh, there's water in the in the water trough. Why am I? What am I doing now? No, don't do whatever that was. Stop. How do I get out of this menu? Cancel backspace. Okay, so there's water there, so I do a thing. Change height. That's a pig pen. Well, it's still a water trough. Where is the, um, where is the, where is the sheep? Uh, they're all sheepish, and I don't know where they are. Hello? No sheep in there. Hey, close. 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 Thank you. That's Q's. Sets the cues. Well, the sheep must be over here then. You set each item and then you can water from the pipe. That's cows. Might well, just have to buy the sheep to find the sheep. The sheep have to have a loading dropping point for the um close that's because that's Say on the big map. Okay. Uh, oh, the sheep are over there. Ah, they're over here. Oh, derp. Yeah. Okay, so I'm doing what with this thing? The sheep are at the bar. Yeah. Rope. 
No, what if I don't want to rotate that? I want to rotate the other thing. Nope, that's not going to do it. Um, confirm select of G. Oh, like that? And how do I change the height though? Like that? <laughs> is that what I'm doing with this? Wow, this is confusing. <laughs> Set the part with the wheel to the side somewhere and the pipe over the trough. Like that, maybe? I want to make it look real instead of fake. Is that is that what we're saying and I should be doing? <laughs> so confused. Yep, that works. I'm gonna wait a moment just to make sure that you're saying yep to the to the correct thing. <laughs> Alright, so we're all good with the pipe off to the side and the thing over the thing with the stuff in the thing. <sighs> Wolfman, do you have this kind of stuff in your farms? Oh wait, you don't have animals. I mean, your co-farmers are your animals. But it works there. Okay, alright, and confirm A. You want to save this part. It cannot be undone. Yes, because Train Man said it'll work. You have no animals. Water is unavailable. Well, yeah, I know. I'm going to get there in a minute. Come on now, game. Give me give me some credit. All right, sheep. Do we want a Dorset, a Merino, a Suffolk, or a Dorper? All right, what's the difference here? A uh, large breed of sheep that grow moderately fast, has moder modest wool production, requires a medium amount of feed as an adult. Okay. Well, Wolfman is a chicken. Um, <laughs> Merino is a medium breed that is used for wool production. It grows slowly, is not very prolific, doesn't require a lot of feed. I like those ones because they're they don't require a lot of feed. Large breed, grows extremely fast, produces modest amount of roll, requires a lot of feed. Uh-huh. And produces no wool. Well, what do I want you for? <laughs> I'm thinking I'm going with the um I'm thinking we go with the merino. What does everyone think? You think we should buy like 10 Merinos. We'll name one of them Dan. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, that's the best I got for an American football joke. We'll, let, we'll give Chad a moment to decide. Do we buy 10 Merinos or something else? You say 20-ish. Oh my goodness. Rusher's letting us spend some money. 20 Merinos? I almost lost my piece of paper with my numbers on it. Feed water daily or they die. But they're going to be in my grass field. So at least for the in initial, I think we're going to be okay. Because they'll be able to eat on their own. Is Rusher ill? Everyone's like, oh my gosh, Rusher's going to let him spend money. <laughs> All right, we're going with 20 Merinos. That's 10. 20 Merinos is going to cost us 10 grand. 
confirm. Sheep! Sheep! All right, now. Uh-huh. Fill her up. Nice. I like that. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go look at our sheep. Wolfman, you can't come. You're a wolf. Just saying. Uh, <laughs> oh, we're gonna name this sheep Dan. This is Dan Marino. Um, it's Judy. That's Jill. Jack. Giuliano. Uh, okay, I'm done. <laughs> That's the best I had. It was just going to go worse from there. I would buy a hay bale or two for insurance. Yeah, but then I have to go get them. Uh, where am I going to put... Okay, well... Or... Ooh, or... Wait, how long... Hold on. Grass. How long is it going to take the grass to grow? What are we at? What are we at? What are we at? Growing. I don't think we're going to be too far off on the grass. <laughs> oh, come on, Wolfman. You liked that. Because um, the other option we could do um, is... Nope. Left control G. We could... We could lease one of these fields, right? Because, like, field 27 here is nothing but grass. <gasps> we could do that. We could lease one of the small fields of grass. Or even one of the big fields of grass. Like, maybe field, well, maybe field 27. Or 29. That one's a small. Oh, 37. 37 is nice and small. Look at that size right there. Let's check field 37 really quick, because I'm thinking we could lease that field, grab the grass off of it, and be good. Hmm, I could rent field 26 or 35 and whoop, get run over by a truck. <laughs> yeah, this grass is ready to harvest. We're going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to... What's this? Oh, okay. Um, buy one from Italy and call it San Marino. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see what we need. We're going to need a uh, mower. I almost got killed by another truck again. We've got this little baby right here, a little 10 horsepower jobber. 4,300 bucks. I'm buying it. You know, uh, we're, we, we're going to need it anyway, and it's like a pittance of money. Um, so we got a mower. Is there a cheapo El Cheapo loading wagon? There isn't. I'm going to be looking for a mod. Hold on, I need to write that down. So remember back in Farm Sim 15, I want to say, 15 when I played Old Stream Farms, we had uh, the old farm pack. And there were those really cheap old loading wagons. I want one of those for this. Uh, we wouldn't want a header, but maybe a wind rower wouldn't hurt us. 10,000 for a wind rower. Feels a bit high. It's also 50 horsepower. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, wait, this one's a little bit better. Why is that one less horse ponies? Oh, because it's not right. It doesn't require a PTO. Never mind. Darp. But it's 23 grand. Oof. But uh, we can we can pick up one of those. You could even rent that one. Bales. We want to look at bales. Do we have an El Cheapo baler in here somewhere? What? There. Well, El Cheapo is a strange term for that one. Um, aha! This is what we were going to do. Um, the no thrower. 
So we can spend $4,000 for the no thrower. Those bales are small enough for us to pick up. Ugh, it's going to be flashbacks to Farmer's Dynasty. Um, so we got that. We can run it on 20 horse ponies. So that's going to work. Still buy a tether. Hmm. 60 too much for us. 40 that hooks to an AGCO. I think we discussed this before. I have no idea what that means. Does that mean I can add more pieces to it? But I could still hook this directly onto my tractor? Or does it mean I got to find something else? If so, we're kind of in trouble because there's nothing else here for a anemic tractor. We do have 40 horsepower, right? Uh, owned items. 45. Okay, we have a whole 45 horsepower, so we're, we'd be okay with that one. Oh, that's right. The Argo is the weight. Okay, so that's 16 grand. We're going to be spending a lot of money, Russia. We're going to be under 100 grand. Just saying. The other option is I go and see if I can find some, the um, FS13 old tractor pack for 19. I think we might do that instead. Um, so we're getting kind of to the end of the stream here. So I think I, I might do that one instead. I might try to get the old tractor pack. Hey, Dan, what's up? Um, and, the, and then, because uh, if I get the old tractor pack, I know all that stuff will work with a 45 horsepower tractor. I'm kind of liking the challenge of running this little tractor because um, it does mean we can't just, you know, grab whatever we want. We have to think through everything. So this is growing. I wish it gave you a percentage of grow. That would be nice. Um, but it would mean at the worst, at the worst, field 37. Is it field 30? No, it's not field 37. What am I doing? It's field, no, it is field 37. Yeah. So field 37, you're not going to tell me what the lease cost is. I'm afraid to press that button in case it just gives me the lease. Huh. I wish it would give me the cost of the lease right here so I wouldn't have to go dig in to figure it out. But whatever, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that next time. I. I get the idea of doing the insurance. Maybe we, um, is it zero a day? Seriously? Lease per day is zero? Oh my gosh. Are we serious? All of those are zero a day? That seems wrong. That's supposed to be the least cost? No icons found for tomato. Great. Horse helper is 300 per horse per day. <laughs> awesome. Um, If that's what it's supposed to cost, then I refuse to lease anything in the game in this map. Because if the if the lease is broken, I'm not going to do it because I want it to actually cost money. And we'll just say that we can't lease. I mean, the worst that can happen is I start a lease, it costs money, I can end the lease, and go into XML and put the money back in. So let's try it. Let's see. If I hit lease. Ah, there we go. Whoa. Uh, for 1024 lease per dog, which probably is day, <clears throat> is 102. No. All right. So that's $102 to lease. Yeah, let me go and find 
some old school mods for uh, for a little 45 horsepower tractor. <clears throat> and then next time we'll uh, we'll we'll have to make sure our sheep have food, and we'll have to make sure our ch chickens. Wait, no, we have to wait for the. <gasps> it's germinated, guys. It's germinated. Hold on, we have to check if the weeds are weeds are a problem because we'd have to lease a weed weeder. Weeds zero. Sweet. Look at that. We've got canola. Canola. All right. Good. Good. We just have to watch this field for <clears throat> for weeds. And at some point we'll. Um, yeah, let me let me find the mods for the, the the old school kit, and hopefully next week we'll have that. What else can I do in the meantime? I think that's really it. All right, excellent. Okay, so um, let's save this before I forget. Saving content. Yeah, I know, but I'm gonna actually click save game just to be sure because you know, I don't trust the game. All right. Uh, thank you all very, very much. Tomorrow, tomorrow at 1 p.m. Mountain Time, same start time as today, we're going to be in Farmer's Dynasty. I've been doing a lot of work in Farmer's Dynasty. <laughs> Six fields is a lot of fields, guys. It's a lot of fields. I'm just saying it was a lot of fields. <laughs> but it's okay. We, we, I'm sure it'll it'll be fine. <clears throat> um, so... <laughs> uh we'll we'll be checking out farmers dynasty um if if um we decide we might jump to pure farming just because farmers dynasty i don't know what's what's the the lowdown on that um we might be like oh this is boring uh, time to go to pure farming but we'll find we'll figure it out um sunday 10 a.m mountain time whatever that is in your local time we are going to be in derail valley um <laughs> yeah it always goes terribly um and then very important, very important. I'm gonna put it in Discord. Um, in fact, uh, I'm going to uh, do hashboard Discord. Um, uh, I'm gonna put it in Discord and I'm also gonna do it on Twitter and multiple times. Just so you know, Fridays are going to be have, they're going to have to change to 4 p.m. starting in August. Um, not the first week, but the second week of August, uh, because actually I have to go back to working on Fridays. Um, so unfortunately we're going to have to move the Friday streams and I actually have to work a five day work week. What the heck is that? I haven't done that in like two months, but we'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Uh, I don't see anyone to raid right now. Um, make sure if you're not already following, uh, Wolfman. 59 if that will work there we go if you're not already following wolfman make sure you are if you like um, um, things and stuff and uh, trains if you also like trains make sure you follow 822 steam because he's always on the trains um, just don't do steam trains in front of him it makes him freak out um, we found that out and of course don't forget also hodge is out there too and hodge uh, plays farming simulator as well um, and then finally he's um, good grief how do I how do I find him so, farms I think that's his tag we'll find out no it's I misspelled it <laughs> that didn't work the way I wanted it to whatever um, Summerlin oh there it went uh, that's probably not correct. So, well, whatever. Summerlin Farms, do a search for him. Amazing guy. He will be streaming in about three hours. So, if you're still around. Um, thank you, Farm. No S. Thank you, Wolfman. Uh, <laughs> all right, everyone. Take care, and I will see you all tomorrow.